Chris yeah. Corning with perhaps the loudest cheering section here at Buttermilk. Drops it now for run number two. Switch backside. 16, 20, switch backside 16, 20. The reason I hesitated is because Chris Corning, you know, he's not really known for his switch backside rotation. After a very impressive second run, we've always said he's a guy who favors those 18s. Do we see it here? I think so. He's been close before. He's talked about how important it would be to his career to win gold here, and he's putting it together tonight. It was very good. Does he try to bring it to a switch back 1800? Maybe he goes backside 19, 80. Oh, yeah. <laughs> he has done that backside 1800 many times. What he hasn't done is that back 1980. Yes, you think, yeah, it's just another 180 onto an 1800, but no, it is a completely different axis. The way you land, the way you have to whip it around. For the record, I was not just thinking Were that. You, okay. no. <laughs> What's he do on run number three here, Craig? We know he wants to do a cab 1800. Let's see if he pulls it out here, dropping and switch. Yep, that's a cab 1800. There goes that man. So what is so difficult about that rotation, Brando, is it's really easy to go early. And what I mean by that, you start your rotation on the takeoff as opposed to waiting till you get to the top, initiating pop and then spinning. Liam Brearley, one of the best at that cab rotation. Liam Brearley, the youngest competitor in our field, just 20 years young, a gold medal last night in Knucklehuck. Right now, trying to get back on the podium in big air. Ooh, I love that. So that's the trick he did at the start. Twitch triple 12. Here, I think he dips this one a little bit more too for that last cork, very upside down, right? This looks switch triple 14 the whole way around. Then he says, nope. Psych. We turn our attention back up to the top. Tieran Collins trying to land something here. Char goes cap 18. What? 1800. Char, wonderful. <laughs> so here's Tiaran Collins sitting in fifth. Switch back 16, and look at the confidence. Because young snowboarders at home, this is how you stop your rotation. This is called contest commitment right here. Switch back 16, height. Look at how hard he digs those toes in. Because if those toes aren't dug in, he keeps rotating, catches a toe edge, and it's gonna be night-night. So Chiarn Collins, yes, Chiarn. That 29. Let's just take a look at this here. As you saw in the graphic, needs a 41. I don't know. There's no getting around it. Rene needs a big make. Can he do what Hiroki did and deliver on his fourth run? Oh my goodness! See, Salema, let's go back to the question you asked earlier. Can you still win without doing an 1800 or a 1980? Tricks like that lead me to believe you can. But instead of popping off his back foot, he pre-spins, pops off his front foot, dumps it over twice with the switch Yo. nose grab. And you think he's gonna keep rotating, but he doesn't. Throws that right foot in front of it. This is so unique. Rene this says, is so different. Give me that. Biggest jump we have here at X Games. So here's Rene Rinakongas. He, he's going front 18. Get going, Rene. Yeah. Was that maybe under rotator yeah, or was that his so end? His score comes in at a 30, Craig. What'd you see there? Everything looks great. Gimbal God right there behind him filming. Everything looks great. It was maybe just that right there. Yeah. A little bit of an under rotation. But hey, Rene having fun, putting on a show, and one of the best handstands we've seen tonight. 
So here's Mons Roisland, again, owner of six X Games medals across 13 appearances. Frontside 14.40 off the toes. Take a look here, look at that snowboard flexed. Mons Roisland. Shout out Alms Dog, by the way, with that message, <laughs> whose Mons is this? Who's That's one of this? our favorite lines. Yep. What's he gonna put down here for run number three? I can't wait to see it. You gotta spin once to the left and once to the right. He already has that left rotation. Monzi, backside 1800. Come get your Mons. Roycelin, run number four. Currently sitting in that silver medal spot, Krager. Have that beautiful back 18. And there's the double 1440 <laughs> oh, off the wow. toes. But what I like about this one there, rotation, I think this is gonna be a higher score than his 34. So right off the toes. Some people would call that a frontside rodeo off the toes. He keeps his a little bit flatter in the way he doesn't, he doesn't throw his head down, he throws his head out. That's one of the differentiators, I think, for me. I know some people might feel different ways, and I'm allowed to have my own opinion. You can feel however you want to feel, Craig. He needs a make yep. right here, right now. Does he go back to the quad? He's jumping right foot forward. He is going back to the quad. Hold your breath, folks. Quad 1800. Get going. Yes! yes! He's already put himself in a field goal position now. Let's see if he can convert. Front side, quadruple, 1800. Filthy. Yeah, that's gonna be a Thayer's hype meter unreal for me there, pal. Hiroki needed something big in the worst way, and he gets it. So here's Hiroki. <laughs> okay, what did I say? He was a two minute drill kind of guy. Okay, he waits till the clock almost runs down and then puts down two hammers. The Love jump before this, view. quad four, quad 1800, pardon me. Here's Taiga Hasagawa, who put down an eight on his style run. Switch back 19, yep. Hold on just a second there, partner. But you have to admire that takeoff. He knows he's going to do one of the biggest spins a human being has ever done on a snowboard, yet he goes up the takeoff so straight. He executes that rotation so perfectly, and watch the way he falls in the landing. This is going to be a huge <laughs> score, Brando. What'd you do today, son? He's going that. He wants to land it. He's going back to it. Taiga Hasegawa on course now. He'll do one. Here's Taiga. <laughs> oh, okay. my. Are you kidding me? I thought his switch backside takeoff was a little bit better, actually. So he's already done the switch back 19. Here he goes backside 19. Maybe a touch early on it. And I know I'm, you know, splitting hairs here, but look at this. A little bit of a hand touch. So not as clean as maybe a sw switch backside one, but two 1980s in one big Whoa, air event. That's filthy. 43 for Taiga. So Taiga Hasegawa, our current leader, Craig. Looks like he's gonna improve upon that switch 1980 score. They had him at a 36. Oh my, good word. Perfect takeoff. Holds the grab for so long, right until the end. Gotta whip that 1980 around, that last 180. And our podium is set, and give it up. Taiga Hasegawa wins his first career X Games medal, and it's gold.